Well, good Tuesday morning. Oh, are you in for a treat today? I'm in for a treat today. Whenever I see this video, I am in, I am in awe. Now, I say it's video because, as you recall, if you've been with us, we're showing the talents that some in our congregation put on display when we had a talent show back in September between our services on a Sunday. This participant not only was out of town that day, but you couldn't display her talent on the stage anyway. So it worked perfectly. Bunny Quartarero is a synchronized swimmer. And she is amazing. She was at a very high level in her younger days. But honestly, I don't see much change. She is still absolutely awesome. So you and I are going to get to view Bunny's water ballet. I call it that. I'm not sure exactly what you do call it uh, accurately. But she is a member and really director of the Aquadets, our amazing team of ladies who put on a, one of the best shows, maybe the best show in the woods every year called The Follies, Aquadet Follies. Fantastic. Do not miss it. And this will just be uh, a little taste of, of what you will see. But Bunny, and this is so touching anyway, honestly, I have to say that Bunny does a fantastic job. She will be swimming or water dancing, water dancing to songs from Annie, Annie the Musical. And if that weren't touching enough, it's sung by her granddaughter. And we'll play the introduction. They get introduced and, oh my goodness. Now here's what I want you to watch for when you're watching Bunny. She opens up with just getting in the pool and literally swimming on the top of the water backwards. You try to do that. Get in the pool and float. And naturally, you tend to, you will go, if you swim at all, you're going in the direction of your head. But Bunny, through underwater movements, is able to swim with her feet first. Now, I got to tell you, I was a swimmer in high school. That was my sport, two-year varsity letterman, and swam at the ocean or like this bay my whole life. I could not do that. I put up this scene just because I could see Bunny in the bay. She, she could do it. She could do it in the bay. Then she gets out in the middle of the pool and puts one leg up in the air. Now, I don't think I could do that if I was laying on the ground. But she stays floating on the water. I wish we had a camera underneath the water showing how rapidly her arms and hands must be moving. It's phenomenal. Let it amaze you. Wow. And then she goes under the water and holds her breath while exercising hard. Longer than I could just hold my breath sitting here. Now, I want you, as we go to the, the, the video, I wanted to go through all those. So that you and I can appreciate the high skill level that Bunny is demonstrating. 
And by the way, all these movements are right on beat to the song that her granddaughter is singing. Wow. Anyway, I loved all our acts. I love this one a lot also. So with no further ado, we'll let the announcer answer. This was in Aquadets 2023. Enjoy, as I know you will. See you tomorrow. special treat, it's our solo swimming performance by Bunny Quartarero, a very special soloist all the way from Idaho, 14-year-old Kylie Ward, who's also Bunny's granddaughter. The musical Annie features music by Charles Strauss, lyrics by Martin Charnin, and a book by Thomas Meehan. It was based on the 1924 comic strip Little Orphan Annie by Harold Gray. The original Broadway production opened in 1977 and ran for nearly six years, setting a record for the Alvin Theater, now known as the Neil Simon Theater. It spawned numerous productions in many countries, as well as national tours, and won seven Tony Awards, including for Best Musical. The songs Tomorrow and It's a Hard Knock Life are among its most popular musical numbers. Tonight, enjoy Tomorrow. As part of our Broadway musical lineup, it's choreographed by Bunny Quartarero. The sun come out tomorrow. That your bottom doll heard that tomorrow. There'll be sun. Just thinking about tomorrow. Away the cobwebs and the sorrow till there's none. One stuck with a day that's gray and lonely. I just took a hunch.